Hey, what's up, Bear YouTube? How you doing? Seven o'clock. Well, actually, it's six o'clock. I'm an hour early. Going out for my coffee. And it's just starting to rain a little bit. Looks like we're not getting a lot of rain this week for some reason. Well, probably because that's that's the breaks. You have ten days no rain. You got to have at least five. What means weather's all fucked up anyway. Um. What was I going to say? Oh, uh, I was just um, watching, uh, oh, sorry, I was just watching uh, YouTube uh, today, and uh, they're saying about shortages in, uh, what was it, bleach, uh, and uh, salt, and plus lots of food things are saying. Now, here's the key. Here's the thing. It's, uh, what are those things used for? Uh, basically sanitation and uh, preserving salt to preserve this shit is urgently needed if we, if we got power grid down situation and uh, they're taking that shit away so you don't have a freaking prayer they're trying to maximize deaths simple and plain and uh eventually the supply lines are going to be completely severed or already is pretty much done from what I'm understanding there's uh backed up ships in the Panama Canal we're not getting stuff from China we're not getting stuff and why the hell did we ever ever get rid of half of our industries and start getting it from China you want to know why corporate greed simple and plain pay them uh people over there two cents an hour and uh, basically got slavery right there and we didn't give a shit. We should have been outraged that they took our industries down. We should have gotten in their face, but that's a cry never spilled milk. That's years ago. None of us stood up and really raised too much hell about that. I mean, there were people that boycotted and everything. But they do that all together, man. It's ridiculous. It took all them jobs away. Anyway, I'm wandering away from what I was going to be talking about. Is uh, They're doing the same thing to us that they did back in the pandemic. All of a sudden, when the pandemic came on, you couldn't find any freaking Lysol. I literally went everywhere in the beginning because I, I didn't know what the fuck to expect. Yeah, I thought something seemed awful weird and everything, but nobody could find Lysol. I was talking to people all around and going into the uh, stores trying to buy it. And they were giving me some kind of bogus a couple times. I heard, oh, they're sending that to the hospitals. Wait a minute. You mean to tell me, even with all that, they're just sending it to the hospitals, the, the Lysol. Uh, okay, well, people wouldn't have to go to the hospital, assholes, if you didn't have germs around the meeting. If you had, if everybody had their own can of Lysol, they could spray and maybe keep some stuff the hell away, you know? Not that it was a disease that you caught by touching, but it may be to some degree a little bit of that, you know? But... They took anything that you had as a weapon against this thing. I call it a thing so they don't, you know, try to censor me. You know what I'm talking about. And uh, they took that away. And the same, you know, the, the, the lights on. The same now they're doing with the salt, which you can preserve food with. You can even clean with salt. Um, shit, people clean cutting boards with salt and hot water. And it's probably the best way for... A cutting board. You don't want to use soap on it. Use salt or bleach. Anyway, um, <laughs> sorry, I crack myself up. I start talking about stuff and I slowly wander away from the subject. It's been my life story with that. I don't know why. But, um, yeah, it's just bullshit. And they don't even have decent excuses for why certain things are all of a sudden missing off the shelf. Water, for instance. Water is essential to life. and You can't get water all of a sudden, hardly down in Louisiana, where they're having salt water backing up into their fresh water for whatever reason, drought. It's basically man-made drought. And it's not climate uh, thing, change. It's, uh, in my opinion, it is. Notice I said my opinion, YouTube, so don't you know, knock me off the platform for that. Uh, in my opinion... It's uh, done intentionally. Uh, they're uh, 
literally weather warfare, uh, evaporation of water, um, direct energy weapons. Could you use that on lakes and stuff and literally evaporate them little by little by little or even greater amounts? Uh, I, I don't know for sure. I don't, but I wonder. And there's probably other ways to do it too. Um, anyway... I'm almost at my destination to get my cup of coffee, and I'm gonna kill this live stream, or this not live stream, this uh, video right now, and I will probably start another one after I drink my coffee. It's my magical elixir. <laughs> it'll it'll fire my my neurons up and get me thinking better. So uh, uh, I'll talk to you in a few minutes.